This is not a car or a musical instrument, but my mother passed this uh, little shark cordless vacuum to me and requested that I take a look at it to see if I can repair it. Apparently, this nozzle here at the end used to spin. And it no longer spins. Oh, wait. Okay. Hmm. So, let's take it apart and see if there's something bound up in there. Maybe some hair. Um, maybe it just needs a little lubricant. First thing I'll do, go grab myself a couple, uh, Phillips head, uh, a Phillips head screwdriver. These things are fairly easy to work on, but they're also fairly disposable these days. Hold on a sec. There. Make it a little easier. Just take this whole part off. So she says, if I can fix it, she'll be most grateful. And if I can't, oh well. She'll get herself another one. And if she decides she doesn't want this, I realized that it still draws air pretty quick and powerful. Aha! Well, look at that. The little rubber band is off its, uh, its location. Okay, let's pull that. Well, that, that'll do it. <laughs> That's quite a difference. Hmm. I should... Let's see if I got any super glue and so ah okay can you see can I get it close see that black line right there her this thing cracked so if I could get some super glue and put that right back on. Reassemble it, it. It should be fixed. And we're back. Okay. Went and got a little super glue. Turned out it was that super glue gel stuff. Actually, I couldn't find any. So I went to my mother's. Told her, hey, I'm working on your project. Um... Do you have any super glue? Apparently we are related because she couldn't find her super glue at first either. <laughs> so did manage to find it. So uh, we're, we're in business here. Let's see this. Oh, good. That's well lubricated. That side's well lubricated. So if I put these in the spots they are supposed to be. Square fitting, I think. Am I am I right? Come on. Ah. And uh, then go ahead and put this geared little band back on I should have a fixed item and uh, she says if she had to replace it, it cost her a little over 30 bucks or something so I'm happy to have saved her a little money let's get this thing put back together I 
sometimes a fix is as simple as that. You think, oh, it's broken. I guess I'm going to have to buy a new one. That's not always the case. That's good stuff. All right. Well, there you have it. Uh, repaired this little thing with absolutely no expense. You know, when, when you have a little project like this and you think, oh, it's broken. I guess I ought to buy a new one. You will absolutely lose nothing if you start taking it apart to see if you can find out what's wrong with it. If you're already in the mindset of, I guess I got to buy a new one, you might as well take a little time and tear the thing apart. You're either going to learn something or you're going to fix something or you're no worse off than you were to start with. And there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Good stuff. Thanks for watching.